Hello, everyone. Teacher Li Ping here. Welcome back to my channel, and I'm so glad to see you here again. As we all know that the holiday season is here, and do you know what are some of the great gift-giving ideas for your Chinese friends and business partners? Today, I'm going to talk about giving gifts in Chinese culture. In my last video, I talked about the top five Chinese gift ideas you should avoid. So in today's video, I will share some common great ideas of Chinese gifts giving. Number one, tea, cha ye. There is a long history and cultural value behind tea in China, and uh, most Chinese people love to drink tea. Myself is a tea lover as well. However, please remember to avoid giving tea bags. Instead, give away high quality tea leaves in a nice tin can. Here are the top three Chinese teas for gifts: Long Jing Lu Cha, Chinese Dragon Well Green Tea, Wu Yi Shan Da Hong Pao, Wu Yi Mountain Da Hong Pao Black Tea, Tie Guan Yin, Tie Guan Yin Tea. It's a type of oolong tea. Number two, fruits, Shui Guo. Fresh fruit is a very popular gift choice when gifted at the Chinese New Year. Uh, symbolizes life, new beginnings, a basket full of apples, oranges, kiwis, and other seasonal or fresh fruits is always a good choice. But remember, no pears. Because in Chinese, pear is li, which sounds exactly the same as the word li, which means to break off or leave. So if you are sending pears to your friends, you're sending the message that you want to break off the relationship with them. Number three, baijiu, alcohol. Alcohol is also a good choice for gift giving. Within the business culture, the custom of toasting and drinking alcohol in China is very popular and important. Therefore, a nice bottle of wine, pu tao jiu, or champagne, xiangbing, can go a long way. But remember to buy a quality brand. Alternatively, you can offer the most well-known Chinese baijiu brand, which is Mao Taijiu, Mao Taijiu, as a way of expressing affinity with Chinese culture. Number four, Hongbao, red envelopes with money. Giving money in red envelopes is very common in China, especially uh, during the Chinese New Year and the weddings and on birthdays. You can give red envelopes to your friends, family, co-workers, relatives, and your employees. The amount of money depends on how close you are to that person. However, there are certain rules and customs you need to follow. Be sure all the bills are crisp and brand new from the bank, no old and crumpled bills in red envelopes. The amount of money in the envelope should never include number four. That means not for 40, 400, 4,000 amount of money. Because the pronunciation of for in Chinese sounds like the word for a death. Avoid offering up a large sum of cash in an envelope for your Chinese business partners unless you are giving a wedding gift. Otherwise, it will be considered as bribery. Number five, bao jian pin, nutrition and health products. There's the old saying in Chinese, Song li, song jian kang, song li, song jian kang. It literally means giving people health as a gift. Some common health products gifts in China include probiotics, multivitamins, famous Chinese herbals such as ginseng, and so on. Number six, plants. Zhi wu, zhi wu. Giving a lucky plant as a gift, like growing Chinese money plant, jin qian shu. Jin qian shu, or bamboo tree plants, fu gui zhu, fu gui zhu. A quick recap on vocabularies in this video. Cha ye, cha ye, shui guo, shui guo, bai jiu, bai jiu, pu tao jiu, pu tao jiu, xiang bing, xiang bing, hong bao, hong bao, zhi wu, zhi wu. Jin qian shu, jin qian shu, fu gui zhu, fu gui zhu. 
All right, friends, this is all for today's video. If you have any other questions in terms of Chinese gift giving, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to it. I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.